Welcome to Moo Moo Math. Today we're going to look at naming line segments. Okay, I've got a drawing up here. It's got A, B, C, D, and let's add an E down here. We've got five points. Let's say I want to name this segment. To name this segment, I can either name it D, A, or A, D. This segment would be named, you can take a guess, C, B, or B, C. What if I wanted to name the segment from here to here? That would either be E, A, or A, E. And how about from here to here? What would you name it? E, B, or B, E. Now, the only trick is, how do you actually communicate that when you write it down? Okay, to name this segment from D to C, one way would be to write D, C with a segment. And notice, I didn't put arrows on that. I have, and you can even put little dots on the ends if you want to, to show that that is a segment and it does not continue. So you can name that D, C, or CD, both of those represent the segment from here to here. Okay, so I'm going to give you a quick overview of the rules. What are the rules for naming a line segment? And the first rule is you need to use two letters, and the letters are always capital letters because those are points that you're referring to. And then you're going to draw a line over it without arrows. So here's another example. If I want to name the segment from X to Y, even though it's part of a line, and I just want to designate that as a line segment, I can just name it X, Y with a, a two dots on the end to show that I'm just referring to this section of the picture. Now if I wanted to name the whole line as it continues forever, there's another video on lines, but I'll show you how to do that. You would just name it X, Y with a line with arrows on it. So that's the difference between a line segment and a full line. Hope this video was helpful.